creating that visibility is extremely important. You know, if you are, um, if you're not getting the desired results that you want, whether it be from a lead generation perspective, whether it be from connections or whatever it is, then you've got to become more visible. You've got to get yourself out there. You've got, and if you're not comfortable saying, then guess what? The best thing that the best advice that I can offer to you is you've got to do something that gets, you've got to be used to getting comfortable at being uncomfortable, if that makes sense. Okay. This is the Game Changers Experience. Deep dive conversations with leading business disruptors, Olympic athletes, celebrities, entrepreneurs, and influencers from around the world. This show will teach you insights about the winning principles in mindset, productivity, marketing, branding, entrepreneurship, business strategy, and more. Hosted by Productivity Authority, business strategist, former elite athlete, author, and public speaker, Adam Strong. Secondly, and I talked about it just a second, I was connection. Okay, what people demand now is they demand to to feel connected, okay? So, you know, especially with the whole kind of COVID stuff is that we're not really able to have uh, one-to-one or even have conversations on a face-to-face basis because what we wear is like a, a serves as a barrier. When we are online, it also serves as a barrier. So we've now got to, we've now got to figure out how is it that we can create deep connection uh, with our audience? How is it that we can keep, uh, create deep connection and come from a place of understanding? Because if we can create deep connection, okay, and this is so important, then we can build upon the relationship. And relationships, you know, over a period of time, it's interesting. So I, <laughs> I was actually speaking to a good friend of mine today. And he was saying to me, Adam, do you know how many hours it takes um, for the average person when they meet someone for the first time to get them in you know, to, than to sleep with you. And <laughs> it takes apparently seven and a half hours. Now, interestingly enough, I want, I don't want you to think that, you know, I don't want you to think about that. You're going to jump into bed with the nearest person or, or someone that you're chatting up with on zoom or whoever, but the same principles apply. And if you want someone to do business with you, if you want someone to, um, if you want someone to uh, work with or, or you've identified that would be a good suit, it takes time. You have to nurture the relationship over a set period of time. And, you know, sometimes it may take five hours. Sometimes it might take 10 hours. Sometimes it may take, you know, a number of years before they really kind of indulge and get an understanding of, of the connection about who you really are you know, as a person and what do you stand for? So connection is so important because we're all human beings. You know, we, li we live in the digital world now where, you know, it can be extremely uh, lonely for people that number one might not be used to working alone, number one, num and maybe even surrounding themselves with different associations. So we've got to create deep connection uh, with our audience. So that's the second thing. The third thing, which I extremely think is so um, important is visibility. You know, so let's just face it, okay? Um, there's a lot of things going out there right now. It can become extremely overwhelming with information overload. And I don't know if you kind of empathize with what I'm saying right now, but you've got to become visible. And when I say visible, what I mean is we've got to become visible and be able to uh, to stand out essentially. So visibility um, is so important. So for example, it is interesting. I, I was having a conversation. Um, I've had, had numerous conversations actually last year. And one of the conversation was, is Adam, how do you do it all? You're out there everywhere. You're on like all the social media channels. Uh, every time I see, every time I, I switch to a social media, you're there. I'm like, that's because I'm having fun. I'm enjoying what I'm doing and I come from a place of purpose, but more importantly, I come from a place of value. My values is, is that I'd love to get out there. I'd love to uh, add value to people and get my message out there in any way, shape or form. So creating that visibility is extremely important. You know, if you're, um, if you're not getting the desired results that you want, 
whether it be from a lead generation perspective, whether it be from connections or whatever it is, then you've got to become more visible. You've got to get yourself out there. You've got, and if you're not comfortable with something, then guess what? The best thing, that, the best advice that I can offer to you is you've got to do something that gets, you've got to be used to getting comfortable at being uncomfortable, if that makes sense. Like, hey guys, I just want to say thank you so much for listening to today's episode. I would love to hear from you guys. Please do me a favor, like this video, subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell button below so that you don't miss out on some of the episodes that we've got coming up. Also, please make a comment in the comment section below. We are reaching out to some of our listeners so that we can get to an understanding about how we can personalize some of the great content that we've got coming out based on your needs and aspirations. My other word of advice as well is to go to our amazing Facebook community where you can meet other creative entrepreneurs and business owners. Introduce yourself, say hi, mention about some of the amazing breakthroughs that you're getting through some of the episodes and network, right? Grow your business. You are with who you become with the five most common people you hang around with. So listen, guys, hope you enjoyed today's episode. We'll see you on the next episode. Take care and see you soon. Bye-bye.